ACA was very good. They uh, they helped us uh, in terms of the development of this uh, water port. And uh, KQ is actually one of the best loaders. Uh, we, were, we were commended by Johannesburg uh, oh. in terms of the way we, we, we secure, we secure this. Yeah. Yeah. Because this cargo cannot move when the aircraft is uh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, but Captain, it also takes quite a lot of time. We were on ground in China for almost six hours loading because they had to get it right yeah. so that there is no movement at all. Yeah. Also, the, yeah. you know, the road itself is sensitive. Yes, yeah. and again, it's a sensitive material. We don't want to, you know, to risk damaging. Uh, welcome everybody to this morning briefing where we have come to witness and confirm the arrival of this uh, 787 which has been carrying a uh, medical surprise uh, from China. And lastly, I would also like to say Kenya Airways is ready in terms of any evacuations required. Kenya, Airpo uh, Kenya uh, Airways is ready to make sure that we provide that facilitation. This is a unique and uh, outstanding performance. Uh, we were getting desperate for some of the items that um, are, are on this flight. And we are glad to see that uh, the cooperation across all government agencies is what is going to help us in winning this uh, war against this deadly epidemic. Uh, just for the record, on this flight, we have been informed that we have got half a million, half a million uh, uh, three-ply masks. We have got 200,000 testing and sampling tubes and this is a very important thing these 200,000 sampling um, uh, tubes are key to our ability to mass test Kenyans without these sampling tubes we would not be able and we were not going to be able uh, to start our mass testing uh, capability but with these tubes now we are able to fast track we also have uh, uh, some 4,000 shoe covers for operations with our frontline uh, health workers, 3, 000, 300 static shoes which are used in theaters by our doctors. We have got 76,000 N95, this is this kind of a uh, mask, um, N95 face, uh, masks, and we also have face visors by those uh, that are used by doctors. Uh, in the next flight, there will be additional ventilators uh, and so on and so forth. So all I'm saying is that um, we are really grateful that uh, Kenya Airways has been able to, to, to come on board and assist us to the extent that uh, they have. We have developed protocols with them on how to travel, on how to quarantine themselves, uh, the, the crew, uh, when they come and when they go, they know what to do. So we are uh, happy about what is happening. And this is because, as you know, Normally, I would make this announcement sometime at about uh, 3 o'clock by when we have got all the samples. But today, because of this particular uh, conference, we will not be having another, another conference. But as we stand right now, at this hour, we have, already tested, we have already tested about 450 samples. Out of these 450 samples, we have already, um, we have already got 12, 12 positive cases. And we have not finished the day. And uh, five, for example, are hotel workers, and uh, another four uh, from our sampling, from our contact tracing, tracing capability. What this tells you is that um, we need to really, really uh, start uh, the testing capacity so that the contacts of those people who are positive can also be tested, and therefore we can be able to maintain and contain um, uh, the pandemic. So on our part, Again, thank you very much, uh, KQ. Let's continue uh, doing this. Let's continue. Uh, thank you very much, uh, CS Macharia, um, for the effort. I know that you have put in place and how much you have fought for this uh, to happen. So, Asante Nisana. I want to confirm that uh, we are doing everything we can uh, to enforce the curfew, to enforce the guidelines that we have been given by the Ministry of Health, and we will step up what we need to do to ensure that we keep our people safe. A lot of people have been asking, are we prepared uh, for more challenges? The answer is yes, we are stepping up preparations uh, in the event. And we pray, we keep praying to the Lord that we don't get there. But uh, 
looking at what is happening around the world, we have reason to be concerned, we have reason to be prepared. Our plan with the county government is working. County government working with the county commissioners have been asked to put aside isolation centers in the event that we need them. Uh, I now can confirm that we have been advised by our colleagues in the Ministry of Trade that uh, we will have enough uh, face masks in the country. And we will support each other. As uh, we have indicated, even we from the security sector, when we have enough masks, we will share some of them to you know, Kenyans who need them, including uh, our border border uh, riders across the country.